Listen, from the back, you have to also keep in mind you have two triangles to get that left leg over the shoulder. We just start here. Look, I need to fall literally this way. If I fall this way here, all he's got to do is start turning to his left and get his head on the mat to the left. Right. You're doing pressure with the same back. Yep. Put it up again. Yeah. All right, so what you got to keep in mind is I got to, I want to fall this way here. So see how I'm like literally right, right underneath him. From here, okay, I keep that hook right there so that this right here, okay, I'm under his arm. So I can always begin to get here, okay? And I can begin to scoop the head and begin to finish on, okay? But let's say we're here, 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 and I push him down in that hole. If he is not breaking his grip right here, remember, if he's defending his hands, you have a lot of great options here. Okay, yeah, but then the hands will go like this. So once he gets it, you push him down into that kind of hole right here. To break this grip right here, you chop right at the wrist right here. And then from here, you're just gonna push this down and then right here. So look, you gotta try and go this way, right to left, okay? Right hand to left leg. But you also have a triangle from left hand to right leg too. This one's a little bit trickier just because you have to kind of maneuver it here and lock it right here. And this is usually going to be just an arm manipulation here because you have it locked up slightly a different way. But again, the same concept applied at the beginning here. Your leg here. This is not a knee bar. It just tightens up the uh, triangle. So as you look, I want to get as high in that armpit as I can in order to be able to have the least amount of circumference or jam or whatever it is. I'm not a psychiatrist. So look, we're here. One, two, three. Chop that right there. Push it. Triangle one, triangle two. Okay. For this one, I got to keep my left forearm by his neck. So I'm here. And then I need to come up on my elbow. But I need to make sure that there's no separation here because his left arm is going out of there and I use that triangle. So I gotta make sure it's over his shoulder. Scoop back right here and I lock it. The second I lock that triangle, I wanna go for the arms and finish the arms. It's the fastest way to finish a triangle. Unless, of course, you wanna dive. It's not really a knee bar, it's just a way to tighten that triangle right there. already over. Look, option one, option two. Okay, my left knee is still over his shoulder. So think of it this way: my left forearm is between my left knee and his left left side of his neck, and my left leg is hooking his shoulder. So as I get here, I'm gonna scoop my hip back. Okay, on my elbow, so I don't open up that hole right here. And now I have that locked up right here. And then you finish it. However you want to finish it here, okay? The key is, don't open. I was right here, okay? Don't 
do this because he'll pull his arm through, okay? And now you lose that triangle. And then you'll probably have to go for something maybe. A little bit of arm logic. Okay. Here. Here, here, here. See how that knee stays there? Because I don't want to give him an opportunity to shove that hand through. If he starts trying to shove that hand through, I'll just lock it right here. Even though I'm not exactly in the best position here, I begin to scoot my hips back here. But again, triangles, you get that arm and you manipulate the arm whichever way it may go here. Here, 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 whichever way. Okay. Left hand on the neck, right shin, left knee, right there. Worst case, you just lock it right here. You could even leave your hand in there and create a little wedge right there. And then you finish it right here. Alright, let's try it. One, two, three. You have a little triangle option one, option two. This is slightly a little bit more advanced. Remember, it's a triangle, not a tri-straight. Ah, oh, see, I, mm -hmm. I said that.